When thinking about a European vacation, popular destinations like Paris, London, and Rome often come to mind, while those bustling cities are undoubtedly incredible. Europe has much more to offer beyond its major metropolitan areas. By visiting some of the smaller towns, you can gain a deeper appreciation for the traditional and authentic sides of Europe. If you're planning a trip to the continent, consider visiting one of these picturesque small towns, which are sure to offer a unique and memorable experience. Before we start, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Let's start. Number 25. Hallstatt, Austria Hallstatt is a quaint and picturesque village located in Upper Austria, along the edge of Lake Hallstattersee. This charming mountain town is renowned for its preserved medieval architecture and traditional way of life. With its cobblestone streets, red roof buildings, old churches, and spectacular mountain scenery, Hallstatt has become one of Europe's most popular travel destinations. The area around Hallstatt has a rich history dating back to prehistoric times and provides visitors with plenty to explore. Some attractions include a Bronze Age burial chamber, a salt mine open since prehistoric times, and the Hallstatt Culture Museum, which showcases artifacts from the Iron Age culture that flourished here between 850 to 500 BC. Other highlights include the Gothic St. Martin's Church, breathtaking views of surrounding mountains, as well as numerous hiking trails for outdoor enthusiasts. Number 24. Colmar, France. Colmar is the quintessential French city located in the Alsace region of northeastern France. With its cobbled streets, half-timbered houses, and vibrant flower-filled squares, Colmar is a delightful surprise to visitors who come in search of fairy tale beauty and charm. The main attraction of Colmar is its old town which has been well-preserved since the 16th century. Visitors can explore cobbled alleys lined with colorful traditional houses, bustling squares such as Place de la Cathedra and Place de Six Montes Noirs, plus numerous charming churches and museums. Some great places to visit include the Underlinden Museum, Bartholdi Museum, and St. Martin's Church. Nearby attractions within reach include wineries for tastings, ski resorts for winter activities, and beautiful hiking trails for outdoor enthusiasts. In addition to all historical attractions, Colmar boasts an array of shops selling everything, from local goods to top designer brands. Number 23, Rien, Norway. Rien is a small fishing village nestled in the stunning Lofoten Islands of Norway. Its beauty is undeniable with its surrounding jagged mountains and deep blue waters, making it one of the most photographed places in the country. This charming village boasts a traditional Norwegian atmosphere, with colorful wooden homes, peaceful harbors, and lush green valleys. The main attractions are related to nature, particularly for those seeking outdoor activities such as fishing, kayaking, sailing, and hiking. The nearby Renbreggen Mountains offers the best view of Rien and other breathtaking landscapes. While those looking for an easier hike could try Munken Ridge or the Renforden Route. Other popular activities include visiting a local fish market to sample some delicious seafood dishes and taking a trip to Ah, another picturesque village nearby. Number 22, Portofino, Italy. Portofino is a charming coastal village nestled on the Italian Riviera, renowned for its captivating beauty and history. With its colorful houses set against an idyllic backdrop of picturesque mountains, blue waters, and lush green hills, it's easy to see why Portofino has become such an iconic destination. The main attraction of the town includes its vibrant harbor lined with expensive yachts, an impressive old castle dating back to the 11th century, numerous art galleries showcasing collections by local artists, plus a number of lively cafes and restaurants serving delicious Italian cuisine. For nature lovers, there are plenty of outdoor activities to enjoy such as sailing trips around the bay and boat tours exploring the nearby coves and grottos, or walking trails, which provide spectacular views over the town and stunning coastline. Or if you feel like getting away from it all, hop on a ferry to one of the many hidden beaches in the area, like San Fortoso di Camoggi or Abbasia di Santo Fruttoso. These are often considered some of the best beaches in Italy. Number 21. Bibury, England Bibury, 
is a quaint and idyllic village located in the southern Cotswold region of England. Sitting on the banks of the River Colne, Bibri is known for its spectacular natural beauty and traditional architecture, making one of England's most photogenic villages. Since its beginning in the 17th century, Bibri has been renowned for its trout farm that used to supply nearby restaurants with this delicacy. Today, you'll still find the River Colne lined with beautiful stonewares that were once used to help manage the farm's fish stocks. The village itself is made up of a collection of honey-colored stone cottages, as well as two very popular inns, the Swan Inn and the Arlington Row. Not far from here is St. Mary's Church, which dates back to Saxon times and offers some stunning views over surrounding countryside. Bibri also has plenty to offer visitors in terms of outdoor activities. There are plenty of charming walking trails that take you through ancient woodland and alongside meandering streams, plus several cycle routes too if you're feeling particularly active. Number 20. Sigishwara, Romania Sigishwara, Romania is a picturesque town situated in the heart of Transylvania. It's known for its beautiful medieval architecture and cobblestone streets, making it an enchanting destination for visitors. The town was first established in the 12th century by German craftsmen and merchants as a stopping point along the trade route between Wallachia and Transylvania. As such, Raharia has long been dubbed the Pearl of Transylvania due to its perfectly preserved towers, churches, and city walls which are still intact from its early years. At the core of Shukcharia lies the citadel, a walled fortress full of winding lanes, defensive towers, and eclectic houses dating back to different periods throughout history. One of the most noteworthy features within this area is the clock tower, built in 1677 which still strikes every hour up until midnight each night. It almost goes without saying that one of Shukshahari's biggest attractions is its abundance of cultural events. Some of these include annual festivals such as the Medieval Festival, held during summer, as well as live concerts, art exhibitions, and traditional festivals throughout the year. Number 19. Rothenburg ob der Tauber, Germany. Rothenburg ob der Tauber is a picturesque medieval town located in the state of Bavaria, Germany. This charming town is renowned for its idyllic fairy tale atmosphere. Cobblestone streets, half timbered buildings, and pastel houses all drenched with old world charm. The first written record of Rothenburg dates back to 1074 when Emperor Henrik IV granted this small settlement the right to build city walls and fortifications around it. This allowed the town to prosper, especially during the Middle Ages or became one of Europe's most important trading centers. Today, visitors can wander through these historic city walls, some parts of which still remain intact from their original construction. From here, many of Rothenburg's famous landmarks can be seen. These include its mighty castle, St. James Church, and Town Hall. Number 18. Bled, Slovenia Bled, Slovenia is a popular tourist destination located in the Julian Alps. This picturesque resort town is renowned for its stunning landscape featuring a glacial lake, scenic mountains, and an ochre-colored church on an island in the middle of the lake. Bled's biggest attraction is, of course, its beautiful lake. Visitors can take a traditional wooden boat, or plenta, out to the island for some amazing views and photo opportunities. If you're lucky enough to visit during springtime, you might even get to see some blooming wildflowers surrounding the lake. Aside from sightseeing around Lake Bled, Visitors can also enjoy activities like hiking or horseback riding in nearby forests and meadows, skiing at Vojil Ski Resort, as well as golfing at Bovec Golf Club. Number 17. Giethoen, Netherlands Giethoen is a small village located in the Dutch province of Oversel. This quaint village is often referred to as Venice of Holland, to its extensive network of canals, quaint wooden bridges, and thatched roof houses. Despite its quiet facade, there are plenty of things to do in Giethorn. Tourists can explore winding canal pass with an electric boat ride, or hire a traditional punter for a more picturesque experience. Visitors can also take walking tours around the village. These usually cover popular attractions such as the gardens at Hojbi Castle, and the Old Art Museum, which offers insights into the local history and culture. Number 16. Schwangau, Germany 
Schwango is a small Bavarian village located in the foothill of the Alps, just a stone's throw away from Noschwassen Castle. What started out as an unassuming farming community has grown into one of Germany's most popular tourist destinations, attracting millions of visitors each year. Noschwassen Castle was built by King Ludwig II in 1869 and served as his private retreat. It's now open to the public and features an opulent interior with ornate furnishings, frescoes, and tapestries. Definitely worth a visit. Apart from sightseeing at these magnificent castle, Schwangno also offers plenty of other activities for visitors to enjoy. For nature lovers, there are numerous walking trails leading through nearby forests, perfect for spotting wildlife or simply appreciating the views. Other leisure activities include sailing on Lake Alpazi, skiing down Tugselberg Mountain, exploring royal gardens like Furstenbrunnen and Linderhof Palace, or shopping at local markets selling traditional Bavarian souvenirs. Number 15, Oya, Greece. Oya is a picturesque town situated on the island of Santorini in Greece. It's known for its awe-inspiring views and charming Aegean architecture, which have made it one of the most popular tourist destinations in the country. The village, which boasts stunning sunsets, is full of whitewashed buildings with brightly colored doors and windows. Oya is also home to some of the best-preserved Byzantine churches, with the ruins of an old castle perched atop a hill offering panoramic vistas over the region. While strolling around, visitors can discover hidden gems, such as art galleries and craft shops, housed within traditional cave dwellings. Aside from sightseeing, there are plenty of other activities to keep tourists busy in Oya. Some popular pastimes include wine tasting at local wineries, indulging in a spot of shopping or tasting authentic Greek cuisine, taking part in yoga or spa treatments, sailing along Santorini's gorgeous coastline, cycling through winding streets, or visiting a nearby volcano. Number 14. Trogor, Croatia Trogor is a quaint Mediterranean town located on the Croatian coast, just outside of Split. It boasts an impressive mix of cultures and architectural styles, with a history that stretches all the way back to the Roman Empire. The old town is listed by UNESCO as a World Heritage Site, and features numerous landmarks such as the 13th century cathedral and other churches, Renaissance fortifications, Venetian palaces, Baroque mansions, and more, many of which have remained remarkably well-preserved over time. Although small in size, Trogor offers plenty for visitors to explore. Take a stroll down its cobbled streets lined with bars and cafes, browse the artists and stalls at its ancient market, or head to Carmelongo Fortress for breathtaking views across the waterfront. From sailing excursions around nearby islands to treks through nearby forests and mountains, there is something for everyone here. What's more, every summer Trogor hosts several music festivals which attract thousands of visitors from near and far. Monembasia, Greece. Monembasia, Greece is a small former Venetian town situated on an isolated rock in the southeastern Peloponnese of Greece. Originating as a stronghold during the Byzantine era, this fortified town today serves as a charming throwback to the Middle Ages, with its well-preserved walls and cobblestone streets. Due to its strategic location, Monembasia served as an important port in the Middle Ages, connecting east and west along the trade routes of the Mediterranean. Today, it remains largely unspoiled, boasting over 500 years of rich historical heritage that are simply unrivaled by modern-day sites. The main attractions in Monlamsia include its imposing fortifications, sprawling ramparts that encircle the entire town, and its many churches adorning its picturesque village. The most renowned spot is undoubtedly the Upper Town or Acropolis, home to numerous medieval buildings including Zafrina's Tower, which commands some of the most remarkable views around. Aside from admiring its architecture, visitors can also enjoy strolling around alleyways lined with cozy taverns and souvenir shops. Or, take part in one of several activities offered, such as kayaking trips along nearby beaches or wine tasting sessions at local wineries. Number 12. Seski Krumlov, Czech Republic Seski Krumlov is a quaint town located in South Bohemia, Czech Republic. It boasts a spectacular mix of architectural styles and enchanting scenery, making it one of the most enchanting destinations in the country. At the heart of it lies the Old Town, built around an impressive castle complex. 
that has been remarkably well preserved over time. The castle filled with Renaissance and Baroque features stands as Seski Krumlov's main attraction. It houses several museums offering insight into its rich past, while its grounds also feature lush gardens and other terraces boasting stunning views of its cobblestone streets below. The town itself offers numerous attractions for visitors to explore, from churches decorated with frescoes to charming cafes which line its riverside. Every summer, it plays host to several music festivals ranging from classical to contemporary, many of which take place within the walls of the castle itself. Number 11. Lovdiv, Bulgaria Lovdiv is a city full of history and charm. Located in southern Bulgaria, surrounded by rolling hills and boasting some of the country's best-preserved Roman ruins and medieval structures, Lovdiv makes for a unique destination that offers something for everyone. The city's main attraction is undoubtedly its Old Town, a UNESCO World Heritage Site housing some of the oldest structures in Europe, including ancient Roman theaters, aqueducts, and mosaics. Explore the cobblestone streets and admire the colorful traditional homes lined with cafes, galleries, shops, or grab a bite at one of its many restaurants. Wander around ancient architectural gems such as the Roman Theater, or take part in one of its lively festivals throughout the year. For those looking to get out into nature, Love Div has plenty to offer from numerous parks to winding trails up nearby mountains. If that wasn't enough, visit one of its several popular beaches or enjoy activities such as kayaking, on Maritza River, or horseback, riding through picturesque countryside trails. Number 10. Sinctera, Italy Sinctera is a stunningly beautiful region in Lograrian Riviera of Italy, boasting some of the most incredible scenery in Europe. Nettled on the northwestern coast of Italy and known as one of Italy's most romantic destinations, Sinctera Terra can be defined by its five villages that cascade down terrace hillsides towards the Mediterranean Sea, Paranasa, Monte Rosso, Rio Maggiore, Mandarola, and Corilacchia. The region boasts numerous attractions from delicious seafood restaurants to winding cobblestone lanes. What makes it stand out is its rare landscape characterized by rocky outcrops, terrace vineyards, and crystal clear waters. It's no wonder that it attracts both nature lovers and art history enthusiasts alike. Visit one of its picturesque villages for a unique cultural experience, or take part in activities such as kayaking, fishing, or around its rugged coastline. If that wasn't enough reason to visit, Cinque Terra also offers plenty in terms of hiking trails along its coastal pathways, offering breathtaking views at every corner, as well as biking tours through rolling hills and lush vineyards. Number 9. Popeye Village, Malta Popeye Village, Malta is a unique destination situated in the tranquil village of Mihalia, Malta. Located on the beautiful island of Malta and renowned for its magical setting and memorable attractions, Popeye Village has become one of Europe's most beloved tourist attractions. It was originally built as a film set for the 1980 musical production of Popeye. Nowadays, this peculiar attraction captures the hearts of visitors from all over the world. The village consists of a charming collection of wooden buildings and attractions based on Charles M. Schultz's classic comic strip Popeye, offering plenty of fun for all ages. The village offers daily shows including Popeye's Musical Revue and Captain Bluto's Pirate Show complete with special effects such as water canyons, rain guns, and smoke machines to bring the show to life. Visitors can also explore parts of the movie set including the Old Mill, Anchor House, or Sweet Peas Ice Cream Parlor. For those looking to get out into nature, Popeye Village is surrounded by lush gardens and crystal clear pools that are perfect for swimming or sunbathing near cascading waterfall pools. Number 8. Toledo, Spain Toledo, Spain is a vibrant city steeped in centuries of Spanish history. Sitting atop a hill looking out over the Tagus River, Toledo is one of the oldest cities in Spain and is known as the City of Three Cultures, reflecting its rich cultural heritage among Christian, Jewish, and Muslim communities throughout the centuries. Visitors can explore some of Europe's most ancient monuments, including Roman walls or medieval churches. The World Heritage Site of Toledo Cathedral should not be missed, an impressive structure dating back to the 13th century and boasting stunning Gothic architecture. Visitors can also explore the city's array of synagogues such as El Trezinto Synagogue or Santa Maria La Blanca Synagogue. Both 
both parts of Toledo's fascinating Jewish quarter. Toledo's home to many wonderful art galleries including Museo El Greco, where visitors can appreciate artistic masterpieces from renowned Spanish painter El Greco, or Meralia de Torres del Salvador, an Instagram-worthy spot, posting views of Toledo that are quite simply breathtaking. Number 7. Slavince Czech Republic Located deep in the Czech Republic South Norwegian region lies Slavonce, a beautiful and unique little town that continues to enchant its visitors to this day. It is one of the best preserved medieval towns in the Czech Republic with winding cobblestone streets, old houses, and a stunning square, surrounded by Baroque architecture. Slavince is known for its many historical sites such as the 16th century Pires Monastery, or its picturesque market square which was established at the end of the 13th century and remains used today. Visit the Church of St. Margaret to experience the Roman Gothic style church, or marvel, at Grand Town Gate, built back in 1558. Make sure you take some time out of your busy schedule to explore Savonce's numerous churches, squares, and monuments. Number 6. Carcassonne, France Carcassonne is an ancient fortified city in the Languedoc region of France. Sitting atop a hill overlooking the Old River, Carcassonne is one of Europe's best preserved medieval towns and offers a unique combination of old world charm and breathtaking architecture. The Old Town, or Cité de Carcassonne as it is known, is a UNESCO World Heritage Site that boasts two sets of fortifications, including the Inner Wall with 52 towers and Barbesian gate, all built between the 13th and 14th century. Visitors can explore cobbled streets, old courtyards, picturesque squares, and admire impressive Romanesque churches such as the Cathedral of St. Michael from above. Be sure to take some time out to visit the city within the city, otherwise known as La Cite, a stunning residential quarter from the Middle Ages which still stands today. For those looking for an adventure, there are plenty of activities available in Carcassonne, including kayaking down the Ald River, or cycling through its countryside trails for amazing views over vineyards and mountain ranges. Number 5. Granada, Spain Granada is one of the most stunning cities in all of Spain. Located in the south of the country and tucked into the foothills of the Sierra Nevada mountain region, Granada offers visitors a unique combination of natural beauty, ancient history, and modern city life. The most popular attraction in Granada is undoubtedly the Alhambra, an impressive palace complex that was originally built back in 889 AD. The complex stands out due to its stunning architecture and intricate carvings, as well as its gardens with captivating views over the city. Don't forget to take a walk along the Dara River near at night for a true fairy tale experience. Other highlights include exploring Granada's many winding cobblestone streets, particularly those located within El Rijalo or Sacramonte. Here you'll find countless charming old houses and traditional tapas bars that allow you to try authentic local gastronomy. Alternatively, why not take a stroll around the lovely gardens found throughout Granada, such as Generalife or Plaza Bibra Badia. Number 4. Budva, Montenegro Budva is a beautiful city on the Adriatic Sea in Montenegro. It boasts a stunning coastline with sandy beaches, crystal clear waters, and picturesque mountains framing the horizon. This charming destination has become an increasingly popular destination for visitors looking to explore a unique culture, combined with the laid-back vibes of life on the Mediterranean. One of Budva's main attractions is its historic old town, where most of its narrowed cobble streets, churches, and buildings have remained intact since medieval times. You can explore around these streets and find plenty of restaurants, bars, and cafes. You may even experience of live music during your stay. There are also plenty of places to enjoy more traditional activities such as strolling around Stary Grad, Old Town, or along colorful Belvedere Promenade, all waiting to be explored. Lastly, don't forget to take out some time to visit Svetvi Stefan, one of Montenegro's most iconic sites which features a tiny island connected by a causeway, lined with cypress trees and umbrellas. Number 3. Havar Island, Croatia Havar Island is a stunning island Croatia located on the Adriatic coast just off the mainland. This small island may be small in size, but it packs a big punch when it comes to tourism. The combination of its Mediterranean climate, natural beauty, and rich culture experiences makes it a musty destination. One of Havar Island's main attractions is its beaches, which range from secluded bays to lively waterfronts. Popular spots include Slanti Rat Beach, Sphinx Bay, and Devapia Beach, each of which of these are perfect for sunbathing, swimming, or snorkeling. 
For those looking for a unique experience, and there's even Plakni Octi Archipelia with plenty of hidden coves to explore and relax in. In addition to its features, Havar Island also contains plenty of natural beauty such as forests filled with olive trees, vineyards, lavender fields, and fragrant herbs. There are many hiking trails and walking routes around the island, making it the perfect place for nature lovers. There's also plenty of culture to explore too, including Renaissance-era architecture found in Sari Grad and intriguing monuments such as Farju Castle perched above the port entrance at Havar Town. Number 2. The Nantes Belgium The Nantes is a charming city located on the Meuse River in Belgium. It is known for its stunning natural beauty and vibrant culture, making it an ideal destination for both travelers and locals alike. One of the main attractions in the Nantes is the stunning nature that runs throughout the city. It's surrounded by rolling hills and dramatic cliffs, providing breathtaking views of the valley below. The nearby Les Gorges de la Meuse provides a unique opportunity to explore this picturesque landscape either on foot or by boat, making it perfect for outdoor explorers. In addition to its beautiful outdoors, Nantes also boasts a fascinating history and culture that can be found everywhere you turn. While exploring around the old cobblestone streets, you'll come across many buildings from the Middle Ages like the Nantes Castle, as well as plenty of churches, museums, and galleries that are made from Gothic times. The Lefe Abbey is particularly special. This monastery was built in 1240 and is now home to Lefe Beer. Of course, no visit to Dinant would be complete without trying some local cuisine. From hearty stews such as carbonade flamande, a type of beef stew made with beer, to gooey Belgian waffles or homemade Flemish cheese, there's something delicious waiting for everyone here. Greme, Turkey. Greme is a beautiful town in the heart of Turkey and part of the UNESCO World Heritage Site, Cappadocia. This ancient city is one of the most compelling and iconic places to visit in Turkey, and it's easy to see why. One of Greme's main attractions are its dramatic rock formations known as fairy chimneys. These cone-shaped towers, carved through millions of years by wind and rain, now stand as a reminder of Cappadocia's each old geological history. They have been home to both Anatolian civilizations as well as Christian monasteries since at least the 10th century, many of which can still be visited today. Hot air balloon rides are also a popular way to explore Cappadocia from above, providing stunning views that will take your breath away. But Gurumi is just about outdoor pursuits. It also consists of plenty of captivating historic sites from old Byzantine churches like Carida Kilse to tombs dug into mountainsides. There's something around every corner waiting to be discovered. What's your favorite European town? Share your own experience or ask a question in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications. Also check out our other videos for more travel tips.